So hello everybody, happy hump day or happy comic book day. This is the day where a camel gave birth to a comet. True story. Happened in Egypt. But today, I want to talk to you about toys. Yeah, toys. Should you keep them inside the box or take them out the box? I don't know. To each his own, I guess. Because I have some toys myself. And I tried to keep it in the box. I really, really tried. But I don't know how people do it, but I just could not do it. I couldn't do it. Exhibit A. See this right here? This is Archangel. Warren Worthington the third. That's three. And when I got him, he was inside the box. I got him from Blue Knight Collectibles. Yeah. This guy right here. Blue Knight Collectibles. Sold to me this toy. And I was going to keep it out of the box. I was going to be disciplined. I said, nope. I'm not going to take him out. I'm going to keep it out of the box where he belongs so I can preserve him forever and for a lifetime. But he has wings. Look at these wings. You can't give me something with wings and tell me to keep it in the box. I just can't do it. I'm not disciplined enough. He was talking to me. He was saying, free me. Free me. My wings must stretch out. I need to soar. And I said yes. And I released them. Was that a good idea? Eh. Good for me because I am enjoying it. This thing is too nice to keep it inside the box. I just couldn't keep it in. And I tried. Check this out. That's right. Black Manta. Had him in the box for a long, long time. Try to keep him in there. But look at him. He has things and everything. The swords come out. The swords come out. Couldn't keep him in the box. Am I wrong for this? If I am, I don't want to be right because I am enjoying this. It's so beautiful. And... Check this out. Superboy and, and Wonder Girl. Both inside the box. Couldn't keep them in. I try, people. I don't know how people do this. I just can't do it. When you, I see a toy that looks look this good. I just got to touch it. I just got to touch it. I got to feel it for myself. I got to see how it is. Move it around. Make it have a party. But keeping it inside the box is just torture. Ah, oh, How do y'all do it? I tried. I just, I just couldn't do it. It started with this guy right here. The wings. The wings got me. Well, that's all I gotta say about that, people. And for words of wisdom and some thoughts, birds can't read. They don't even want to try. It's so sad, but it's true. I've talked to a pigeon recently, and he told me he he told me why he didn't want to read. Now, what he had to say may offend some people. But this does not come from me. This is coming from the pigeon. I wrote it down. Okay. This is from the pigeon now, not from me. The pigeon said this. <gasps> See? And that's why birds don't read. Well, peace out, everybody, and a happy comfortable day to you, and a sweet and a happy, fantastic bumblebee tuna.